Hello my darlings and welcome to my channel. I hope you're doing okay, especially if you're watching right now when I'm, I'm making this video. But this is a timeless reading, so no worries. Uh, today is a new moon or uh, about to be a new moon and also a new uh, astrological year that starts from March 20th. Uh, and um, it's very important during these days to basically start a new life. <laughs> Maybe to throw certain things, to donate certain things that you don't need anymore to get rid of things that doesn't please you anymore, doesn't please your eye, or just do some cleaning. <laughs> um, anything can help here, okay? Because um, from now on, uh, you need some space to have new things in your life, to maybe get rid of some toxicity, toxic people around you, whatever it is, it could be related to things, people, uh, if you cannot do that uh, yet, at least start uh, going that way. Start planning that way. Some cleansing um, also can be good in your house, in your space, wherever you are. Anyways, I just wanted to give you some uh, tips here. Uh, for me, I'm literally moving places, so I had to get rid of so much stuff and also donate a lot of stuff and I feel so uplifted. Um, I didn't even know that uh, those dates will align with this new astrological year, but everything happens for a reason and I'm very happy about it. So I hope you also will have some new start up if you didn't already, but you can also uh, think about what uh, you did during the last two, three weeks, maybe something you already started or maybe you already were thinking about uh, some new start up or to change something in your life. Uh, maybe you naturalist um, right now, today decided to do, a, a, you know, I don't know, cleaning in your house or something like that. It was uh, unintentionally, but your energies, your intuition told you that this is time. It's time to do that. Anyways, uh, let's start our reading. Uh, I just wanted to give you this information in the beginning. Felt like it. And um, you may choose from pile one. It's going to be a gray um, candle or pile two, this silver candle. Okay. And we're, we're going to look at the new energies that are coming through for you. Again, this is a timeless reading. You don't have to worry. <laughs> you don't have to be here exactly now when I'm making this video but preferable. <laughs> Anyways, uh, let's start with pile number one. Hello pile one, whoever chose this uh, gray um, candle. Let's look at you. What kind of new energies, new vibes coming through? new information, what you need to know about yourself. Just relax. Okay, don't think about anything or anyone. Don't distract your energy. My pile number one is very uh, stable today. Very, um, I want to say aggressive in a good way, where you say to yourself, I'm ready. I don't know what you're ready for, but your energy is shifting or literally just shifted today, maybe when you watch this reading and you told to yourself that, okay, I'm done with all this that I was dealing with before. Now I'm ready to move forward. That's the energy I pick up right away. I also see two people interact, uh, having some fun. You may have some fun within the next uh, three days up to three weeks. You're going somewhere, pile one. You're going to have, uh, it. I don't know, it seems like, I even see, wow, I literally see a new moon. I don't know if you are, but look at this. This like crescent moon over here, beautiful. During this new moon, I see you uh, being around people, even animals for some, 
I don't know, maybe you're going to a circus or a zoo or um, wherever you're going. For some, you will uh, literally buy a new pet and it's going to be a new member in your house, okay? But you're going to have a great time. I see money sticking one to another. I want to say like that. Um, during the next few weeks, you will start receiving. For example, if before you were giving, 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 paying, 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 the last or like the recent month or so, right? Now you giving out, like the universe is paying you back in a way. It could be in a small amount, in a big amount, depends how much you give out. Not literally, again, with your energy. And um, the universe will send you a backup, um, you know, free gifts I hear, uh, you will start receiving. It's time to receive, I want to say. Because you gave out so much already, it's time to receive. So for some, somebody will pay you back. For instance, you um, loan some money to someone and they will give you back. Basically, you don't need to ask, you don't need to beg, or you don't need to worry about it. Okay, I see a bird and I want to say some news are coming from afar. This is a far, um, and not just far, it's a far in time where you long awaited for this news. You, this matter, whatever it is, was going on for a long time, maybe for years even for some. And now this matter will again come to the surface and um, you will hear news about it. I hear a long time conversation when will pick up again and you will be able to uh, get some answers for yourself. Mm -hmm. Okay, interesting. Listen, I see a person with a baggage or with some stuff, they're coming to you for help. This person needs, uh, I don't know, maybe they will need some um, one night to stay at your house. Maybe they wouldn't be, there, there is nowhere to stay for them. Maybe they will argue with their loved ones and they will go and come to you and say, can I sleep at your house tonight? Because I don't feel well. Uh, this person will be asking for help and uh, the universe is telling you, if it's not <laughs> for, you know, if they're not taking you for granted, then yes, you can help this person, whoever they are. Could be your relative, your friend, but you know this person. And I see you willing to help. But the universe is telling you, please, don't take it as a habit because if this person and you know they are toxic or you know they uh, can take advantage of you then just do it a uh, one-time deal don't uh, let them think that you can do it all the time they need you with forever they're coming with forever um, uh, situation that maybe they need money or maybe they need to stay at your place for some time depends <clears throat> somebody already have tickets on hands like you flying somewhere you i see a flight number 103 or something to do with uh, number one zero and three it could go different ways or it could be in between your numbers but i hear 103 and tick your ticket i see your ticket and um the universe is telling you no worries the flight will go smoothly you will be okay everything will be fine if you worrying about something no worries if you worry how you will be um Dealing with everything when you're actually there, 
wherever you're going, you will be okay. No worries, you'll figure it out. But I don't see this as a vacation. It's more like you're going somewhere to, to someone or with someone. I don't know. <coughs> well, someone's going to New York. I see a Statue of Liberty here. Okay. I see a wings of an angel that uh, looks like uh, a heart. And then on top of it, I see a cloud. And I want to say um, it could be that you have some um, cloudy thoughts about your love life or about a certain person that you love. And um, your guides, your angels with their wings, they're helping you to figure it out. They're about to give you an answer. They're about to give you a message about uh, this um, person or your love you're about to receive and i hear it's gonna be the word big big could be like on a huge or big uh billboard you're gonna see the name of this person or um something i don't know why big but on some something huge it's not as, as like little letters that you see or numbers this is not like that it's going to be something big or a big statue that you're going to suddenly see and it's going to somehow ref be referred to this person or to your situation in some way. Some people here have sleepless nights or very difficult uh, nights when you wake up you feel uh, your body hurts. It's like you never slept and you feel uh, drained here and I want to say that um, it's very good here to cleanse yourself to get rid of also I see before night time either you taking certain pills or you I don't know drinking lots of coffee or you eating something heavy you doing something before you go to sleep or maybe you exercise before night time and you don't wait until your body comes down um, and you go to sleep and it all affects your sleep time your rest you cannot rest so pay attention to what you're doing before you go to sleep uh, and change something around there change something there because here it's not just your energies are heavy it's more about what you're doing that affects your uh, good sleep It's just for those people, not for everyone. Mm -hmm. I also see a heart with knives in it, three knives. Uh, for some people, and I see two people are kissing. For some people, you may be or remain, I hear, in a third party situation and it hurts you. It hurts uh, all three parties, I want to say here. If everyone's aware of each other, I don't know. Uh, very specific information comes through. Uh, I want to tell you if you thinking that the situation will, will be resolved on its own and um, you don't really have to do, you just have to wait until um, whoever they are, wh whichever third party will just, you know, somehow disappear. No, here the universe wants to tell you in order to change this, in order to uh, heal your heart, you have to make a decision. Whatever decision it is for you, you have to, you must make a decision here because otherwise you will continue struggling or being hurt um, in this kind of situation. And uh, in my on my channel, I don't judge anybody, but when I see specific message that uh, for specific people who are watching this reading and feel resonated, connected intuitively, you have to get out of here. Of there wherever you are because you are in the dark right now you see when the candle come became less uh, you know lightened you have to think of yourself first and foremost and understand that this whole situation is um, is toxic 
Yes, it hurts. Yes, it's difficult. But the whole situation you in is, is toxic and you cannot really start a new life until you deal with the old one. And if you heard the beginning of this reading, and I said right now, is a <clears throat> new moon and a new astrological year, it's time to start new, to make decisions and to move forward with your life to attract new things into your life okay so be aware let's look at your wax <clears throat> mm. hell number one someone is into you here they're melting <laughs> they may melting when they see you and you may even feel it yeah they, they, they totally fell um they see you as, as such a nice person nice energy beautiful attractive um you uplift them it's like look at this <laughs> they they are here right looking at you while you like look at your leg it's like you're dancing <laughs> you're showing them some uh, moves i don't know maybe you're literally dancing with each other maybe you in a group of you know in a dance class but here a person is looking at you and looking up to you and see you as such a beautiful um <clears throat> person beautiful energy and they are uh, melting when they look at you and your eyes and your body but this is not just like um intimacy it's more of your energy your energy uh, uplifts them when they see you they're happy I even here when they don't see you they're not happy they may even be depressed those days when they don't interact with you I don't know how you interact for most of you it's face to face but it could also be uh, online uh, wherever you can interact here at work <clears throat> and uh, some person is melting <laughs> because they are into you they like you um i cannot say they love you here because it's more of a person that uh you're not that close with them okay and now i have uh literally 11 11 on my clock so i want to say maybe this person is your future partner okay <laughs> uh your divine partner maybe not for all this is general reading remember so that was your reading pile number one. Thank you very much, guys. Uh, let me know in comments how it resonated with you. And I'm going for pile number two. Well, hello, pile two. Her, we chose this um, silver candle. Let's look at you what new energies are coming through what information you need to know what you need to know to hear maybe to understand about yourself wow pile number two is completely different from pile one or the energy has um, I see bright colors but those bright colors they don't they don't cheer you up okay I'll explain to you your energy and if it resonates with you or you can continue watching because sometimes I have different energies coming through the same reading <clears throat> it's like you have um, more or less everything is okay in your life or maybe you have a job you have a person <coughs> you have money i don't know <coughs> sorry you have um your health but you're still not uh, satisfied for some reason <coughs> <coughs> you see even my throat is difficult to talk right now um it's like you have all the colors, but those colors don't satisfy you anymore. Or your life in general, for some other people, it may, you see even the wax doesn't want to come through. Your life in general, um, wow, okay. In general, it uh, may seem from other people, it may seem that you're doing great, that nothing really happens. 
<clears throat> but those people they don't see that you deep down you something is destroying either it's inside of you in your family or <clears throat> something is not going that well how it seems on the picture how it seems on the outside on the surface okay <clears throat> what does it even mean for you like what you need to know about this situation And look, I have this lifting weight. You know how people lift weights? I, I have this image here. I want to say, uh, whatever you're going through right now or your life is difficult energetically for you, you, ha you have this heaviness in you that you want to get rid of. And you saying to the universe, maybe you're praying, that you want new colors in your life. You want new um, <clears throat> excitement. You want new energies. And maybe people around you, or maybe in general, you cannot change this phase of yours. You're trying hard. Maybe you're working a lot on it. you trying to improve. Maybe you're trying to work on your health, your body, um, <clears throat> your relationships. Uh, and you. it seems like it's not happening for you. And uh, you want to change this situation. Okay? I see a person praying. I don't know about you. A person is praying. I'm making a wish. And I want to tell you guys, pile number two. You think that you still are in those energies that I was just describing. But in reality, you're already on top of it. you already on top of it. Which means you about to change this I don't know what you're doing I don't know what you did or maybe what you're about to do uh, again if you didn't watch the beginning of this reading please listen I'm talking about a new energy that coming right now with the new uh, astrological year new uh, moon and so forth you can watch this part it doesn't matter when you watch this reading it still can be helpful some tips for you and um, I want to say you breaking through in the upcoming 10 weeks yes it still could be long for you but because all this energy that you've been in all this situation was going for quite some time heaviness uh inability to change and uh it requires some time for you to change it so within the next 10 weeks you will see progress you will see progress. If it doesn't resonate with you, skip this part or watch the first pile, okay? What else you need to know, pile number two? <clears throat> I see um, an elephant with the... Um, uplifted um, nose how do you call his nose <laughs> forgot and I want to say when you uh, in the close future you will celebrate something maybe it's related to uh, information that I described before or it's separate so you wow I even heard you will be introduced to new people here new group <clears throat> of people for some it's gonna be your new job that you're gonna go to for others it's a new group of people that on the same uh, frequency with you or will uplift you you will have a new uh, hobby or new new thing you're gonna do here and those people they will help you to improve. Maybe even teachers, coaches. Uh, 
I don't know how you're gonna find them, uh, but you will get, your intuition will lead you towards this group of people. I see two people holding hands, uh, looking at each other and kissing. Uh, they also whisper into each other. It's like, uh, uh, I'm gonna tell you what they say, okay? They say, nothing will set us apart. Nothing will change the way I feel about you. And the other person said, nothing will change my feelings for you. It seems like for some of you, you either in love or you love somebody for a long time, but there are certain obstacles between you and it seems like you cannot um, resolve them. And you say to each other, energetically, or maybe literally, you say to each other, nothing will uh, make us apart. We'll always be together. No uh, obstacle can uh, erase that kind of love, that kind of energy. But this is mutual, mutual feelings with somebody. And I want to tell you, um, <clears throat> I see a ray of light coming to those people. And uh, the universe will guide you both towards each other soon within the next few months you will be uh, forcefully <laughs> when i say forcefully it's in a good way because it's coming from your guides your angels the universe itself uh, god wants to put you together and god will m make certain situations in your life when you will be pushed towards each other to be together because you were meant to be together so you will start feeling this push in the already in the upcoming days whoever this person is i don't know uh, you will be pushed towards each other in a very fast movement where you for instance i'll give you an example you didn't plan to go anywhere and suddenly something will come up and you'll need to go somewhere and then uh, you will interact with this person you will you know see each other for some reason you didn't expect it you didn't have to go there but the universe forced you to do it because some issue appeared and you had to do it this is just an example of how uh, what forceful means you will appear in certain places where you didn't plan to be in. For some, it's a new love. For some, uh, you may not know this person, but you energetically already manifested them. And the only thing left is to manifest them in uh, a 3D. But for, I hear 70% you already have feelings for each other, or at least beginning feelings for each other, or you energetically feel this connection you may be not even understanding why uh why you feel this why you know you attracted to them why you have this pull towards this person maybe you only met once i don't know or nothing like that ever happened and it's a general reading i cannot say for all but the universe will do everything to put you together in the upcoming months and you will be surprised by the situation itself how exactly it will happen interesting i see a certain uh, individual that's coming to you and they're not whispering but they're more like they speak very quiet their voice is very uh, calm and quiet. And when they start speaking, the other person or people around them, they instantly become quiet because they want to listen. They, they want to make sure that they don't miss out. And imagine like it's even a thing. When you uh, come into a room of uh, lots of people and suddenly somebody starts uh, and it was loud and everything and suddenly someone starts talking it's very qu quiet talking everyone else becomes quiet and this person coming 
towards you and tells you something and you will listen they I hear they tell you a story this story could be their own life story in two three sentences this could be a random person on the street um, they tell you something you hear it and you continue going with your life and then you realize a um, few days later maybe a few hours later something going on in your life and you somehow remember this person and you put that, the dots together you put those dots together and you real and you're gonna have this aha moment like wow okay I thought it was random but it actually was a message to me and I also hear the words what should I do now you're gonna be a bit confused but um, relax this confusion was needed here guys I'm just channeling I cannot I tell you uh, <clears throat> the logic of it it doesn't have to have logic this is a spiritual um, reading but if you're gonna feel confused even overwhelmed for someone it's okay it's normal it's needed because this confusion will eventually bring you to the right answer oh my god I just heard for some if you weren't confused <coughs> If you weren't confused, you will choose the wrong answer. You basically will choose wrong. For some, you needed to make a decision between two things. Or in general, you needed to make decision and you made it uh, very fast. And then this person comes and you start being confused and say, why? now i feel that it wasn't right and then you changing your um, path you changing your decision you changing you, you make turn you make turns into the completely different direction maybe you choosing between um what kind of profession what kind of major you have to take but this is just an example it could be literally anything here okay let's look at your box more <clears throat> pile two. Oh, I see two people kisses kiss and hug each other so much love I want to say you will receive so much love in the close future or this love that's coming to you is so nice so um, generous and uh, healthy that you will float in this love and you're gonna give thanks to the universe that you received it you got it you I hear the words finally Look, I see a bird, and then in this little uh, silver box, I see an owl. Bur um, white bird looks at the owl, and I want to say, for some reason it tells me day and night. And here, your days will be more... You will have basically will have happier days um, rather than uh, sleepless nights soon if before your day was like very going very quick and you couldn't accomplish anything and at night you couldn't sleep because you were stressed now it's going to turn you're gonna have brighter longer days good days 
and uh, at night you're gonna sleep so tight that you wouldn't even feel how the night passed by you're just gonna fall asleep quick and wake up in the morning fast uplifted and happy yeah, okay all these beautiful things are coming to you pile number two thank you very much guys i love you all and i'll see you in my other videos bye bye